How's it going, everyone? I hope you're doing well. It's Richard. Welcome back to Push Ups for PTSD and Day 1305, Day 26 of 125 Push Ups a Day, as we travel down this road to spread awareness about suicide and mental health. Sending my well wishes to everyone watching, and I want to say thank you for your support. I hope you're staying safe. Quero apenas enviar meus votos de felicidades a todos que estéo estestinado e a gracia pelo apoio. Je suis simplement adressés mes milliers vous a tous que qui regardent et vous remercier pour votre soutien. Today feels like a bit of an odd day. Not sure why though. Sun is out and shining, but the wind is blowing and keeping it nice and cool. Aside from that, I've been trying to get some chores done in between acting as teacher for the day. Can proudly say we've done math, reading, art, and PE, aside from lunch and snack time. Luckily, all I've had to do is follow my wife's schedule for the day, which has made it a whole lot easier. Got a bit upset at seeing my youngster's abilities during uh, basic physical education, and can only assume that uh, what they're allowed at school wasn't much of actual exercise. I assume they had fun, but when a jumping jack or a squat that they've told me they've learned is too far-fetched for them to do, I can only believe that when it comes to physical education, the school has uh, begun to let us down. Oh well, I have time to help them out and hope they can at least learn the proper form and movement. Today I have more motivational quotes for those with PTSD. Trauma is hell on earth. Trauma resolved is a gift from the gods. Peter A. Levine. After a traumatic experience, the human system of self-preservation seems to go on to permanent alert, as if the danger might return at any moment. Judith Lewis Herman. Delusional pain hurts just as much as pain from the actual trauma. So what if it's all in your head? Tracy Morgan. You have to understand that PTSD has to be an event that you experience, a very traumatic event. And actually, there is evidence that brain chemistry changes during this event in certain individuals where it's imprinted indelibly forever, and there's an emotional association with which triggers the condition. Dale Archer Bad things do happen, how I respond to them defines my character and the quality of my life. I can choose to sit in perpetual sadness, immobilized by the gravity of my loss, or I can choose to rise from the pain and treasure the most precious gift I have, life itself. Walter Anderson. Most of us have unhealthy thoughts and emotions that have either developed as a result of trauma or hardship in their childhood or the way they were raised. Steven Seagal. A lot of people who have experienced trauma at the hands of people they've trusted take responsibility, and that is what's toxic. Hannah Gadsby. One of the things that pains me is we have so tragically underestimated the trauma, the hardship we create in this country when we treat people unfairly, when we incarcerate them unfairly, when we condemn them unfairly. Brian Stevenson PTSD occurs following a trauma that it was so awful that in retrospect you don't understand how you survive. What that causes is an extreme feeling of vulnerability that you get past but that doesn't go away. Paul Goulston what we change inwardly will change outer reality. Plutarch. Today's physical slash push-up update. Felt like another strong day today. 50 on the first set. And continue to do either 12 or 13 push-ups for the following sets. That probably means that I was able to accomplish my 125 the quickest I've ever done it. But I haven't yet checked back and edited the footage to find out. We know if it's my shortest video in the last 26 days or not. If not, that's still fine, as I felt good. I did another 30 plus minutes on the stationary bike last night, and got another 30 in this morning before my push-ups. I'd say physically, it's been a good day. Through all of the craziness in the world though, I hope everyone is doing well. No matter how many it be inside or outside, it's just a moment in time and it will pass. Make sure to take care of yourselves and stay safe. If you enjoyed this video and the daily updates and messages, please like, subscribe, and share to help spread awareness. Thank you for your current and future support, and most importantly, thank you for surviving.